New developments to tell you about in a story that we have been following for months now. Today we're learning that a change is coming to a child detention center planned for near downtown. Channel 2's Sion Rhodes spoke with the mayor about this and she's joining us with a look at what's changing. Sion? After months of protests and even a legal battle with the city, Southwest Key making major changes to move forward with this center. Southwest Key programs have been working since last spring to get city approval to house unaccompanied immigrant children ages 0 to 17 at 419 Emancipation in downtown Houston, something Mayor Sylvester Turner had spoken out against. That was unacceptable. Uh, the city is not in the, in the business of supporting anything where you're separating kids from their families, and it was more in line with being a, like a detention facility based on the initial application. So that was rejected because they never put forth, the, brought forth the necessary plans to even qualify for the application that they were initially requesting. So we said no. Opponents also organized protests against the shelter. No justice! No peace! But the nonprofit group that contracts with the federal government recently revised its city permit application to shelter only 16 and 17 year olds. And the city says Southwest Key is now entitled to operate with a residential certificate of occupancy as long as it makes repairs cited by city inspectors. The mayor, though, stopping short of saying he supported this revised plan. I'm not going to say that I'm comfortable with it. If they meet our regulatory requirements, whether I like it or don't like it, it is what it is. If they met our regulatory requirements, then we're obligated to provide the permit. In downtown Houston, Sion Rhodes, KPRC, Channel 2 News.